so i will give zero angle and length is width so width is the distance so in this way you can uh, use the polar function to create the next reference point from some point in some angle and in some length so if you have some all these three data you can create a next point so this is the point 2 has been created so i want to create point 3 that i will say upper right corner of the rectangle so i will say set q point 3 then again i will use the polar function to uh, locate the next point so from point 2 i want to locate the point 3 at 90 degree so to give the 90 i can say uh, so you have to always keep in mind the angle should be in radian so i will say here pi by 2 pi by 2 so that it will be a 90 degree pi means 180 degree so pi radian is 180 degree so i will say pi by 2 that is 90 degree and uh, length will be height distance will be height so again closing bracket for the polar closing bracket for the set q now i have point 3 then i want to create the point 4 suppose so uh, that will be your uh, upper left corner so i will say set q point 4 then i will say polar then which i will be creating it with respect to point 2 point 3 suppose i can create it with respect to point 1 also again in the 90 degree or uh, just for the so we will understand more so uh, so point 3 should be in 180 degree on the left side from the point 3 so we have created that in 180 degree that is pi then we will give the distance is width closing bracket so we have located all the points then after that i want to create the rectangle so draw rectangle so to draw the rectangle i will use the command function so command to create uh, to use any autocad command you can use the command function whatever autocad command you want to use that you can use in autolist using command function so i want to use line command suppose line so whatever is the sequence on the command prompt we follow the same sequence you have to give here so after line i am giving space so after that i have to give the pi, uh, line will ask me for the first point so i am giving point 1 then next point point 2 point 3 point 4 i have to connect back so i will say again point 1 and to end the line you have to give the double quotes uh, you have to give the enter so in autolift enter is giving the two double quotes will act as a enter so i will here is the command function and in this way our program is completed for creating the rectangle so i will save it suppose i will give rect as a name then I will load this file program then I will give the command rect so he is asking me for the width width is 5 height is 2 and the left corner so this rectangle is created so in this way we have created the rectangle so thanks for joining we will stop here